Woo. We back. Part three. My yo yak. Still ain't figured out how to say it because there's no videos out there in English. My yo yak. My yo yak. But uh, yeah, we at day 25. Day 25 and so forth. You know, those of y'all that don't know, it's taste day. So, we got the strawberry going on right here. And it's, and it's ready. So, we're going to taste it. Stay tuned. We're going we gonna to get to this one. You know, it's been sitting. It's supposed to be ready in 21 days. You know, we're about at day, well, we are at day 25 right now. You know, so... It's going down. It should be ready. You know, gave it a couple extra days to sit in there and marinate. Um, if y'all don't know what's going on with this, go back and check out part one and part two. And, uh, yeah. So, we got, you know, the soju right here, which is what's really, you know, got this infusing and, and getting all mixed up and everything. So, yeah, you got to let them soak. Got to let everything mix up, come together, and get ready. And, uh, yeah, it's ready today. So in case y'all was wondering, we still got figs over here, sweet fig. This one's still, you know, doing what it need to do. You know, sitting in there, soaking it up, marinating. This one about ready. This one this one is, is tomorrow, you know. So we're going to get another video taste testing, taste testing sweet fig. And that's coming up. In about a day or two. We're probably going to get to that one tomorrow. If not tomorrow, the day after. And then we still got the King Stamina. You know. We got a while left on this one. This one. <laughs> we got 91 days to sit and wait on this bad boy. So we're not even to the halfway mark on this one. We're only 20 days in. So we got about 70 something left for this one. So, Yeah. It's going to be a while. But anyway, strawberry. This one should have a little bit of, well, not a little bit. It should have a lot of the strawberry flavor in it. It should have some hibiscus, a little bit of peach going on in there. You know, if y'all remember from part one, you got the sugar in the bottom. So it should be kind of sweet. You know, but uh, yeah, we're going we gonna to get this one going here in a second. So I got to get out here and um, pour this one up. What I'm going to do is I'm going to. I'm going to filter it out because I don't want all of this in my uh, cup. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to I'm gonna have to filter this down a little bit because, I mean, you got all this going on, you know. And then you got all this going on at the top. So, I'm going to try to get a a good flavor of the of the, the drink without, you know, chunks and all the rest of that. You know, I don't do all the different kind of consistencies and all that. I need to be just smooth and um yeah so stay tuned i'm gonna get this uh i'm gonna get this filtered i'm gonna get it poured up in a cup i'm gonna be right back hold on and we back <laughs> just like that you know i didn't filter it down too much you know the uh filter was taking a little longer than, uh, than i expected but hey I'm about to get a little snort, as the old folks would say, <laughs> you know. But uh, yeah, got a little bit poured up here in the glass, and uh, I was supposed to give y'all a little smell test before I poured it up, but I forgot. So we're gonna do that right now, and uh, huh, it's a little different. You smell like it's. Just <laughs> Yeah, like it's ready to go. Can smell that soju in there a little bit, but not too much. Not too much. But uh yeah. Got a little bit going on. Hold on a second. You know. Got a little floaters in there. But you know, that's all part of the process. But anyway, let's see what it's all about. Ooh. Ooh. Mm. Yeah, that 30%. It's a little, uh, hmm. Got a little bite to it. Got a little kick to it. You know? Uh, yeah, that's all right. 
Let me, let me, let me see if I can get some flavor out of this now. It ain't bad, you know? And keep in mind, I'm hitting this up room temperature. Probably gonna go ahead and sling this in the refrigerator now. Let it get a little cool. Maybe if I threw a little piece of ice in there. As a matter of fact, hold on. Let me go. Let me go throw some ice in here. You know, let it uh chill for a second. I'm gonna be right back. We're gonna try this again. All right. So I got a cube of ice in there. You know, I don't know if y'all can really see that or not, but we're gonna let that chill for a second. And now I'm thinking about when I went and I tried this at the cafe show. And so I'm thinking trying to remember how cold it was i believe they did have them um chilled because i do remember the lady taking it out of um a bucket that had a little ice in it so yeah they did have it chilled and it was a little smoother and a question i did forget to ask them when i was there was if it was supposed to be 30 percent um 16 percent 25 percent so did you i went for the 30 um that's more of the higher end because it comes in like 16, uh, I think 16, 25, 30, and 35, I believe. I don't know if there's one between the 16 and the 25. So I went a little bit on the higher end or the higher, not end, but the higher side of it um, for alcohol content. Didn't do the 35. Um, but uh, yeah, it got a little kick to it. I mean, when when I tasted it, at the cafe show it was smooth you know it didn't have as much bite in it um it was it was lighter you know but it ain't bad though don't get me wrong it's not bad it just got a uh that room temperature you know you, you drink some bourbon or something room temperature you know you'll get a little more um get a little bite on it once you you know put a cube of ice or something and then let it let it sit for a second and smooth out so let's see what it's talking about Yeah, yeah. No, that's what it need. That's what it need. It need, it need. it need one cube of ice. Let it melt. You know, let it let it cool off. Let it chill out a little bit. <laughs> it need to chill out. So let it chill out a little bit. And uh, yeah, it ain't bad. Now nah, you, you you can sip on this. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, this ain't bad, this ain't bad, and I'm thinking, thinking if I do it again, I'll probably drop down to, i probably drop down 25%, um, yeah, I might drop down 25% and try it again, you know, keep testing it, keep trying it out, seeing what it's all about, um, but right now though, I ain't mad at it, it's, it's, it's you know, it's fairly uh, aromatic. Got a lot of got a lot of fragrance coming off of it. Mm-hmm. The more it's chilling, the smoother it's getting. You know, it's not hitting like it was on that first sip. I ain't gonna lie, that caught me off guard a little bit. But um, but yeah, we are gonna let this one keep sitting, and then as it sit, I'm gonna sip. But uh, yeah, so like I said, stay tuned. This one, it, get, it gets the thumbs up. This is a definite uh, win. Strawberry, can't go wrong with that. Um, you know, can't go wrong with that one. So if you want to try these out, I would say this one should be number one. You should try it for sure. Cause it's got a little bit of sweetness going on with it. It's got a good, you know, strawberry flavor to it it's got a, it doesn't you know you're not getting too weird yet uh i feel like as we go down the line the weirder you're gonna get so i think this fig is gonna uh you know i think that one's gonna start you down the path of um weirdness <laughs> and then i think when we get to this bad boy and i think that's you know 
we're in a whole other level at that point. But like I said, you know, you got to stay tuned for this one because this is, you still, you still 70 something days out on this one. So it's going to be a while. But uh, yeah, thanks for uh, joining in, watching. And uh, we're going to be back in a couple of days to hit the fig one. Peace.